Uh-huh. Yeah. Extra pepperoni. 30 minutes or it's free? Hey, great. That's... Oh, oh, it's a shovelware's brain game! <laughs> Don't adjust your TV set. That's just how he looks. Here's the dancing banana! Monumental landmarks. <laughs> A fun filled trip for you and your friends to Shovelware Studios Hollywood. You can ride our world famous attractions like Shrunken School 4D and Super Slime Spinulator. Take a peek behind the curtain and see how the magic happens on our iconic VIP studio tour, including a stop by our newest soundstage where you can have a chance to participate in a live taping of Shovelware's Brain Game. Hey, wait a second. Let's bring out a special guest to ask the next question. It's Forty the Smart Board. Hi, everybody. I'm Forty. Take a look at this photo I took on my last vacation. Where am I? I'll be in my dressing room if you want an autograph after the show. Bye! Sports Mix. Okay, guys, check this out. I have a new strategy that will totally turn the sport of basketball on its head. Instead of dribbling the ball like everyone else, I will simply pick it up and run down the court to the basket. Here I go. <laughs> what? Oh, come on. What? What could I have possibly done wrong there? Science rules. What is the largest organ of the human body? I want to know for, um, reasons. Not a chance. Math Zone! So if you needed to write 200 questions for a quiz show, and you only got 60 of them done, um, how many more would you have left to write? Uh, asking for a friend. <laughs>
Zoo Pals. You're going to Brazil! That's right, you and your whole family are going to Brazil! Explore the sights and sounds of South America on this six-month-long mandatory excursion to Rio de Janeiro that you cannot back out of! I repeat, you will be locked into this obligation with absolutely no way out! This cannot be undone if you win this prize! I'm looking forward to seeing the famous flightless dodo when I next go bird watching. and... What's that? There aren't any more? There haven't been for hundreds of years? Oh, what's the word used to describe when the population of a species is completely wiped out? It starts with an E. Big laundry. Uh, apparently there are shoes made completely out of wood. And they're surprisingly versatile too. They often are used for protection while working on farms and mines, but also utilized in many traditional Eastern European dances. What is the name of this style of shoe? That's just plain wrong! Talking about states. Somewhere in the United States is a region called the Four Corners, made up of the corners of four connected states. I want to go there and just hop between the borders. You know, ooh, I'm in this state. Ooh, now I'm in this state. <laughs> oh, much enjoyment to be had. Anywho, which of the following states would I not be hopping into in that scenario? Oh, that's just plain wrong. What's the word? What is the most common word used in the English language? Oh, hey, I just used it in that sentence. Eyes on the prizes. How many vitamins and minerals do the caveman vitamins contain? Uh, uh. 
Trains, planes, and automobiles. Car battery! That's right, we're gonna milk this bit for all it's worth. Say, before the use of batteries in automotives was widespread, how did someone go about starting their car's engine? I give up. A novelty soda drinking hat. With this on your head, you won't have to worry about using your arms in relation to drinking your soda ever again. Until you run out of soda, well, then you'd have to use your arms to remove and replace the soda cans on the sides. Actually, if you could do that without using your arms, that'd be pretty impressive. Ooh, I want to see that now. You're this episode's Grand Champion! Another round for the books. Be sure to stick around for more right after the break. Shovelware's